Beltway battle is brewing. Good evening. I am Mark Edwards. I'm Anna Manuel. Thanks for watching Fox 23 News at 9. County officials pushing for a beltway around Hattiesburg to ease traffic, but city leaders say no mm -hmm. way. Yeah, they're worried about businesses losing money. Fox 23's Corey Howard looks at both sides in our top story. Traffic jams alone could ruin a person's daily commute. That's why Forest County's Board of Supervisors for District 2 Charles Marshall says he and his team are looking at a way to reduce traffic congestion. And what we are discussing today is the uh, continuation of 42 from the interstate of uh, 59 and Edenville Road over to 49, which is where 42 goes into Summerall. A plan mapped out showing different alternatives that could help relieve traffic from running through the city of Hattiesburg. However, some Hattiesburg Council members raised concerns about the idea, saying rounding traffic away from the city could have a negative impact on Hattiesburg's economy. It is a valid concern for them and it is a valid concern for the, uh, for the Board of Supervisors because the Board of Supervisors don't want to do anything uh, that would uh, hurt uh, of the city of Hattiesburg. Marshall explained the benefits and the disadvantages the Beltway could bring. And uh, the pros are you would get to point A, point, get from point A to point B a whole lot quicker with less traffic. Reducing the amount of traffic could cut down the amount of road delays and accidents in the area. However, the negative to the project involves money. The negatives are, are the money that uh, we're going to have to uh, try to find to uh, complete this project. Marshall also stated they would have to purchase the property needed in order to complete this project. However, some residents may refuse to sell their property. Now take in mind, this is only a proposed study at the current time, and the city of Hattiesburg is not against the idea of putting in a beltway, but they do have some concerns that they would like to address before moving forward. I'm Corey Howard reporting in Hattiesburg, Fox 23 News. A public meeting will be held in Glendale Community Center to discuss the plan for the beltway around Hattiesburg on Fe February the 15th at 6 p.m.